Good morning guys, it's Em and welcome back to another What I Eat on Weight Watchers Personal Points. If you're here and you're new, hi, I'm Em. I'm actually on my uh, weight loss journey yet again. Um, a few years ago, I lost all my weight on Weight Watchers and mental health and life got in the way and I've regained it back. So I am starting from scratch. So hey, I'm Em. If you do hit the subscribe button and you follow me, you might see some of my old videos pop up um with old points plans but recipes are still relevant you can always re-input them and it's kind of fun to see me along the years so if you look back and you see me really thin at some point that is why but hi i'm em definitely give me a like and a subscribe and comment down below if you're new here or if you've been a long time follower i'd like to chat with you guys in the comments um but yeah so i've already started off my day with my skinny tea um i'm going to make a breakfast here soon um, but yeah, this is the outfit of the day. Ignore the messy front entranceway because young kids, you know. Um, my friend just gave me this jacket from Jean, Jean, Sheen. Um, and I think it completes this look. It's really cute. I've got like gold eyeshadow on today. I'm feeling it. So I feel ready for the day. I do have a bunch of errands, not errands, things I need to get done in the house, like, like laundry. So... I might try to film that as well. I don't know if you guys like cleaning inspo videos. I used to do them and people did like them, but let me know if you want me to do speed cleans or clean with me's or things like that as well. Um, I try to incorporate day in the life type stuff, not just what I'm eating because what I'm eating can get a little boring and I like to connect with you guys on all things. So anyways, I'm gonna go, I'll come back when I'm eating something. Okay guys, so I just wanna show you, this is the bread I've been using. It's two points for a slice. So I did a slice of sourdough bread. Um, I did two teaspoons of basil on it. I did one point's worth of cheese, um, which was like nine grams of the cheese I had. I did a slice of turkey bacon and then a fried egg. Um, so it's seven points and then I have a apple and some cinnamon and I'm going to have a full glass of water and that is my breakfast. So I'm just outside of the school and I'm going to do lunch duty. So I was just talking to my friend Celia actually. You guys probably remember her from the Motivated Muffins and it was Celia and Cherie. Anyways, Celia is back on WW Personal Points as well. Hey Celia, if you're watching, hey girl, hey. Um, anyways, we were just talking for a little bit about how last week went and everything. And I was saying I have yard duty and she didn't like, I don't know if maybe just the way I said it, but she didn't get what I was talking about and I had to explain. So yard duty is like outside supervision for lunch time at the school. So I get paid for the lunch hour and I do like 20 minute blocks. So I'll do like 20 minutes supervising like them eating, 20 minutes outside, and then I'll do 20 minutes of reading just to fill the hour. Anyways, I'm like digging this fit today, guys. I think it's super cute, but it's really cold. It's, well, it says it's three degrees out, but I did bring my winter jacket and I have to put that guy on top. It doesn't really match the fit, you guys. Um, but yes. I think I'm going to make a salmon bowl of some sort tonight, but also put cucumbers and carrots in it. Oh, goodness. And I'm not sure if I'm going to do that when I first get home and have it as lunch or if I'm going to do it more as dinner. I think I'm going to do it as lunch. Um, and then maybe have a shake or like a lighter dinner. We'll see. We'll see how it goes with the points. Really that lunch, that bowl is not very many points. Um, I just, I wanna make sure I get all my veggies in today because I've been struggling and I end up having to eat them all at night and I don't like that. Um, so I should snack on some veggies. I know that if I do my bowl with cucumbers and carrots, I can probably get about a half a cup because I think I'll do like a quarter cup of both. Um, Anyways, I'm basically just thinking on camera. So I'm gonna go and we'll see you guys later. Hi guys, I am back from lunch duty. And I am I got so hungry and I was like kind of tired when I was there and I feel like I'm gonna take a nap. But anyways, I went and got this massive bowl from Quesada. And I figure it's probably gonna be lunch and dinner for me. 
And I got a lettuce base with a bit of rice, black beans, corn, tomatoes, cilantro. I got a bit of guacamole because that's zero for me. I did top it with coleslaw. I asked for a little bit of cheese and then she like dumped like half a scoop on there. So I'm counting that as like five points because I think that that looked about right. But, and then there's sour cream on here. So anyways, I like put it into the app thinking in it. Oh, and it's spicy chicken is the meat thinking. So I was thinking like, oh, it'll be like maybe like 15 points. It's 19 points. Mind you, this isn't through like their nutritional info. Cause I thought, well, a lot of these things are like zero points. So anyways, it's showing 19 points. So I might look at it a little bit more in depth after my nap. Um, <laughs> and run it through their the Quesada calculator for the nutritional info and then see what it says my bo my points for the bowl is from that because to me I feel like for all of this veggies and stuff yes there's sauce and cheese on it but like 19 points it's pretty huge though I guess it's kind of like two meals anyways I'm gonna eat this I probably can only stomach half of it anyways I usually can only eat about half they used to have this half size one which is like just the regular size and they discontinued the regular size so I'm gonna dig in I do have the 19 points it just only leaves me with three points for the rest of the day but again if I eat this for now and the rest for dinner then we'll probably be good too so <laughs> anyways guys I'm gonna check in in a bit I want to show you guys. I literally, it was full, but I only ate like <clears throat> half of it, or maybe two thirds of it. And I'm like stuffed. So I'm going to see if I get to this later on. <laughs> also, my mouth is on fire because their spicy chicken, I feel like, depending on who makes it that works there, can be very spicy or not that spicy at all. And I think whoever worked there today really likes spice because. Okay, I'm gonna finish my drinks here and go take a nap. Okay, I'm up in my room hiding from my kids, but I figured out how to track my food from lunch. So I went to the Quesada website. I'm gonna show you guys. The Quesada web website, and I did check with the people what they use in their chicken, and it's just the spices. So I am not counting the chicken, but I went to the website and you can go through it and um, scroll and select everything that you want counted. So I just put like the beans, the rice, the cheese, um, the coleslaw, things that I knew costed me points, the sour cream, the cilantro lime sour cream. Anything that was pointed, I put on there and then I entered that information into my phone and it came back with nine points. Now the only thing that it didn't count was the corn. And they literally just use like a sprinkle of corn in there. Um, and I'm just gonna count the corn as one point. Um, I think I counted a quarter cup of corn, even though I don't even think it was that. So it was 10 points for the whole bowl. And I got two cups of veggies out of it. So anyways, if anybody else likes quesada, definitely do this. Put the items that you don't know the points of um, through the app, just build it. Um, and then just don't include the zero point items. Um, it's going to save you time and mental energy <laughs> from doing it and probably over pointing yourself. Cause I have repointed myself to almost 19 points when it really was only nine. So I did finish that for dinner. So at this point I'm not hungry. I had that just now. Um, I probably will have something for a light snack later, but I just wanted to show you guys that because I was like, how am I going to track this properly, blah, blah, blah. And most of it's just veggies and stuff, but I wanted to make sure that I tracked it for their cheese scoop and stuff. Um, and funny enough, like I said, I didn't even have like a full scoop of cheese. So for all I know, this still could be slightly more points, but I definitely like the sound of 10 points for the bowl that huge bowl over 19 like I feel like 19 and it was definitely like me picking a healthier option because <laughs> like I was just feeling so drained I honestly could have just went to the drive through somewhere but I went and picked that so we're all good we're good bougie um 
I have my hat on. I just caught like a chill when I was picking the kids up and now I'm like freezing cold. Yeah. It's seven o'clock and I'm making a snack. I'm gonna show you guys what I had, but also I'm gonna add, I had a bite of Edison's Subway cookie and an eighth of the cookie is one point. So I'm just counting a point for it, even though it was like a very small point or bite, I'm counting that. So just keep that in mind. Measured out 20 grams of Cheez-It crackers for three points. Um, I love Cheez-Its and I wanted to have some. And then I have a tablespoon of this light peanut butter for two points and then an apple. So this is five. I did have another snack, like that bite of a cookie, which is a point. I'm going to fill this up with water. But yes, this is five points. Just some cinnamon on the apple. The water I've drank today and the vegetables I have eaten, I have six points left for the day. I don't know if I'm gonna have anything else. I personally don't like to eat those extra points. I feel like it's like a bonus that I get like a rollover. And then if I do have a splurge meal or something, I can pull from my weeklies, but I'm really trying to hit that. I really wanna do 40 pounds by the end of February, so. We're trying for that. I'm gonna have my snack and I will see you guys later. You know what time it is? Colin tea time. So I didn't have, I didn't remember that it was colon tea night. <laughs> and I was like all tucked in and I'm like, nope, now I need to make a tea. So before you have this tea though, you should have a whole glass of water if you ever try this because it's gonna be better for your system if you have the extra fluid. So I'm gonna have this and then I'm gonna make my tea. Okay guys, so I had my tea and I am zonked and I'm off to bed. So I want to thank you guys all so much for watching my what I ate on Weight Watchers personal points. If you enjoyed this, please give me a thumbs up and comment down below. Um, say hi, let me know where you're from, if you're following a plan, what you're doing, and subscribe if you want to see more videos. Bye guys!